Hi, it's Philip Ayn, this is in a video session today. Um, we're going to talk about the contract extension of Owen Toll. And yeah, let's ask into the video. So yeah, so um, to today, uh, Toll has extended his contract on 2027 for the Whites, which is brilliant, brilliant news for us. Um, as, of course, his deal will be running out summer 2025. It's not this summer, the, summer, the year after. Not the, not the summer coming, the summer after, so summer 25. His deal will be running out along with a lot of other players, one of them being a certain Rico Santos. Um, yeah, so it's good news um, that Toll's toll contract is renewed till 2027. That's brilliant news for, for us because it's... Um, Again, very brilliant player though and tall, doesn't really put a foot around. You know, still progressing as a footballer. Brilliant player. Um it's good to have his contract since twenty twenty seven. You know, which kinda brings up kind of the other question, who else are we gonna renew? You know what I mean? Because he got twenty twenty five, he got loads of players really they got Santos, Jones, Williams, Baxter, Coleman, Dakas, Cogley, you know, etc. Um, are we going to renew them? Probably not. Like, I was going to say, like, I was going to, on the Instagram post, I was going to message that, oh, could, could renew Williams' deal, but I don't think Williams is a favourite. To be honest, it's just people just quickly to dismiss him. That might just be the Twitter mode, but people just dismiss him, like, like Tom knows. They just don't really care about him. Um, so his contract might get renewed. Santos again is is he's at what is he twenty eight? By next summer, the next, the next year will be what twenty nine. So he'd be he'd be gone. Surely he'd be gone. Um, think about it as well. Next, if we don't go up this season, next season's Everett's last season. You know what I mean? Um, so it's likely. You know, I don't think he'd even go up next season. You know what I mean? Like, to put it to put it correctly, Everett ain't the man to take us up, and um, Everett will be a V two, volume two version of the O'Neill. Um, so very likely, I won't be surprised if if Rico sent us and call goal. So meantime, because I don't think there's any point in renewing Santos's deal when he's gonna be what twenty nine. So it's like what's the point of that? Um, so we've got to find new leaders. You know, Toll being one of them potentially. Thomason. You know, Tall Lord Thomason, they'd be they'd be good leaders, they? they'd be good leaders. Probably yeah, Tall Lord Thomason. They'd be really good leaders, you can imagine. Thomason could be a good leader in the future. Tall could be a good leader in the future. Again, John's his contract's running out as well, and he's twenty eight, so he'd be he'd be twenty nine as well. So it's people gonna be going to twenty nine by the by the end of next year. By the end of, by next year. So we've got I think we don't go up this year. I don't think we will. Like, I don't think we are. I'm like, we've got Barnsley tomorrow. You know what I mean? It's like, we've got Barnsley. And like, we're not going to win that. Barnsley, you know what happened? You know Barnsley. Like, last season, playoffs, we got bummed. You know? And now it's just... <laughs> you know what I mean? I think they're going to do us again. They are gonna, Barnsley are going to do us again. They've got good players. Barnsley are going to go up. With Portsmouth and down, the bands are going up. Like this, ooh, Bolton's doing the old promotion race. No, we're not. Forget the promotion race. So I see a third for now. Yeah, until tomorrow night. I mean, if we lose, we're fourth. Then forget about promotion. Fuck promotion. That's all I can say. We're not. We're not got. We've not got a team to go up. We've not got the team to go up. It's not a championship style team. If Charles is injured. Bax is injured. Mendes Gomez is injured. Johnston's injured and the Dulu's injured. I'm like, come on. You know what I mean? We've not got a team to go to the championship. Come on. We just don't. We don't. I think if the best we can do this season is play our final. And hopefully I'll be able to go to that. So saying that, we lose that as well. <laughs> We'd even lose that. I think we would. So ironically, I think Barnsley. So Barnsley would just do as well. Barnsley would be Barnsley, aren't they? Barnes get too good. But even if let's say if we don't face Barnes, we still get twatted. We're just too bad. I think we will face Barnes in the playoff final though. 
and then get like someone like Blackburn who likes and beat them at like, home second leg or something like that and then draw their players in the first leg. But we're just we're not got the team not got the teams go up simple. We don't go up this season, Emmett's last season, next season, and then I don't think we'll go up then, therefore I think he'll go. If we don't go up next season, then he's he's gone, you know, sacking. You know what I mean? Then we look for different managers. Um but there's a lot of players going to be going next. Well, that, 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 the contract is 2025. I don't think there's any point renewing Santos' Santos's contract, Jorn's contract, um, you know, Lords. I don't think we're going to renew Williams. Baxter, if that probably goes into like next season, you have literally just got him this season, so it's like you'd likely get him next season. I'll get him, likely renew his deal next season. Um, but yeah, it's like. I don't think we're going to renew Williams' contract. If I'm being honest, I just the fans just don't like him for some reason. So that'll just be it. <laughs> that'll just be it, I think. In terms of contract, that'll literally just be it, if I'm not mistaken. There might be some others, but I might, that might just be it in terms of contracts. Um, and, of course, I think next season we've surely got to try and find some because we need, we need reinforcements next season. I mean, we've got to find new captains. I think Tolan and Thomason will be future leaders. Tolan and Thomason will be future leaders. Thomason is the only kind of player who gives the foot most of the time. To be honest, he just... Wait, he even scored it when we lost 4-1 at Blackpool. He scored again. And he scored on Saturday. You know what I mean? He's... He, Thomason's like that shining light in our team now. Think about all the injuries we've got. He's that shining light. I'm trying to think of the... the yeah, he's that shining light, isn't he? He is that shining light. Thomason is, he's that, he, I kind of see him being, like I said, I see him being a future captain. I really do. Him and Saul will be future captains of this team. When Santos and Jones go, right, again, because of age and, of course, the contracts, I think Toll and Thomason are going to be future captains. Thomason could, could literally, could be captain. That's the thing. He's, he's got the bloody... You know, he's got the bloody traits for captain, you know what I mean? If I get to look hard and like, oh, well, fucking so be it. You know what I mean? We're all expecting of Thomas and doing something, you know what I mean? It's, we need that aggression sometimes in a team. Um, but, yeah, that's really it. So, yeah, that's about it. That's in the video. So, yeah, please leave a like, subscribe, turn on notifications to make sure I'm going to have the next post. Roll to find subscribers, please drop the like button, speak the subscribe button. Share this uh, to your mates or, you know, who are fellow Bolton fans or even if they just love football. Just, you know, don't forget to comment and share, um, you know, share the, share the videos, share the channels and get more people on, on the trail to 500. And yeah, peace out.